everybody i decided to vlog on this camera today because it's just a little easier to carry around and it's a lot lighter but i'm gonna do an ootd so today we're going out and about i thought i'd bring you guys along and be fun there's most likely going to be a little haul so um yeah so ootd my top is from windsor store my cardigan is from Nordstrom Rack. Um, I think my bandana is from the dollar store. Um, belt is Target. Shorts are Kohl's. They're, yeah, they're Kohl's. Um, and then, yeah, I'll probably just wear my white works. <laughs> Where's the cat's bell? Kika, Kika? <gasps> no, it's right here. It. Oh my god, they have it. <laughs> oh my god. I'm dying. Okay. Well, How much is it? $4.99. <laughs> Hello! So, we just got Hello. back from Ulta, TV Max, and Home Goods. And Hello. we got the bowl that we wanted that I broke yesterday. I got the lipstick that I wanted. Um, and then I found a variation of the table that I wanted, but they didn't have it in the color that I wanted. So, yeah. So, I'll do a haul for you when we get back. Oh! Yes. It'll, she'll just do this over and over and over. <laughs> Nothing will deter her. I need to get a car stand. So, ready kitty cat. I got this bowl, but I broke it last night. So we got her another bowl. It's so cute. I know, kitty cat. Oh, it's so cute. So that's what we got from Home Goods. And we also got this basket, basket for Faith's room, but whatever. And then from Joanne's, we got some Cricut Everyday Iron On. This one comes with pink, purple, and blue, and this one's black and white. And then from Ulta, I got this palette, so it's from Essence, and it was $9, and it's called Fairy Wings and Magical Things. I've been looking for a colorful palette, but I feel like all the colorful palettes, are like the, the ones are like really expensive, or you know, like at least 15, 20 bucks, which isn't that bad, but you know, like I'm not gonna use colorful as an everyday palette, so. Um, I found this one for $9 from Essence, and it's really pretty, so I decided to pick that up because I have a 20% off your purchase coupon. And then I got this, which is supposed to be a dupe for my favorite lip glow, which is the Dior lip glow. And I love it so much, but it's $34. So I figured I'd wait till Christmas or, you know, just a different time. So I got this, which is supposed to be a dupe. And it's the Essence Kiss the Frog um, lipstick. And I swatched it, and it's so pretty. And I was, I was also going to get the Mermaid and Unicorn one, but they didn't have the Mermaid one, which is the second one that I wanted. But they did have the Unicorn one, but it was just, like, too purply that I didn't really want it, you know? So... I wasn't going to wear it, so I just decided not to get it. And then from TJ Maxx, I got this lipstick. Um, it's the Too Faced La Creme Color Drenched Lip Cream. And I got it for $5. Um, and it's really pretty. It's in the color Marshmallow Bunny. It's not the same color that I thought it, I thought it would be because of the packaging. Um, but surprisingly to me, because this was the last one, it wasn't used at all. Um, so it's pretty, it's pretty pretty for the office. <laughs> so, it's a little essential oil diffuser, and it's really cool, because I have one in my room, but I want in the office as well. Oh, you need batteries? I have never heard of an essential oil that needs batteries. Oh, and it came with a little cup. Okay, so, it's, it comes with a little remote, so you can change the color. Um, high, low, on, off light. So I thought that would be nice. And then it came with battery score. And this whole thing was like $13, I think. Something like that. And then this is a little diffuser. It's really cute. It's just a white diffuser and you can change colors. 
and the little cord, and it comes with a little little thing for it. How cute. Okay, so this is so cool. Hello, so I'm back. I mean, obviously, it's my channel. So, um, I wanted to swatch all of these palettes, this whole palette for you guys, because online it says that there's soft mattes in here, but I don't think there is. So I'm just gonna swatch them all to see. Also, I know my eyeshadows jank. I don't know what happened today. And then I also I tried on both these lip products, and I like them. But I figured I'd show you guys because I didn't show you guys. So let's just do it. Oh, um, I don't. Um, there might be one matte. Yeah, the other one is oh, Fireflies. I really want this to be matte. I, I think it is. It's not the best though. So that's Fireflies. It's not bad though. Okay, and then this one is. Ooh, this one's pretty. It's like a. Literally, it's unicorn tears. You guys can't really see on camera. This one is Wizard's World. Ooh, she pretty. Ooh, she pretty. Oh, you guys can't see it here. Let me see. It is so pretty. You guys, like, it's not showing it. It's not giving it justice on camera. Yeah, sort of. That orangey shade is gorgeous. And then we have off to Fantasyland. I think this one might be a matte. Oh, no. And it's magic. It's right next to it's Fantasyland. Oh, that's super pigmented. And then Fairy On. And I think Fairy On is the only matte. So the top is very like whimsical, pretty colors. I really like this. I'm super excited to use it. And so far, like on the top, so this is all just the top um, row. I think the pink one is the only matte one. The fairy on so far is the only matte one. These are all so gorgeous. I feel like there are a couple of colors that look super similar that I think it would have been nice if they put a matte purple in and a matte blue in. But for nine bucks and the 20% off too, like that is a really good palette. And then just buy matte purple and a matte blue, which single shadows usually aren't super expensive. So I totally recommend this palette. I'm going to have to see how it goes on my eyes though, which I'll be doing tomorrow now. So Essence Kiss the Frog lipstick. This one. It's green. They're really pretty. So, if you guys don't know, the Dior Natural Lip Glow. Where is this? It might be in one of my purses, actually. Yeah, it's in one of my purses. So, the Dior Natural Lip Glow, I'll show a little picture, is essentially a, um, like a lip balm type consistency that just brings out the natural color of your lips. So this is the Kiss the Frog. And I think it looks really similar to what my Dior Lip Glow looks like. Oh, this one on. This is the Too Faced La Creme Color Dredged Lip Cream in the color Marshmallow Bunny. It's a little bit more um, like metallic-y than I wanted it to be, but it's not that big of a deal because I feel like it'd be a gorgeous lip topper. Like I tried to over top this Kiss the Frog. It's really pretty, I'll show you guys. An occasion look. It is really pretty though, but it is quite shimmery. And it's really gorgeous. It's just a beautiful lip topper. Um, so I feel like I would classify this more as a lip topper than a lipstick, but I can totally see why they said it as a lipstick too. So, hi, I'm completely out of towels and I want to take a shower. So we're doing some laundry. So I use my own fabric softener because um, my mom buys dryer sheets instead of fabric softener, but I personally love using fabric softener. I personally see a humongous difference. So I have been using the Mrs. Myers and the Honeysuckle scent. And then we also have the detergent in the Honeysuckle scent, but we haven't finished our other detergent too. Oh, we haven't finished our other detergent, so I'm trying to finish that off before I start the new one.
we now need to go to the new house because um, our garage floors are getting done um, and we have stuff in the garage so we need to clear all that out. So my dad is going to meet us at the new house because he's at work right now so I need to get him an outfit. So I think I'm going to switch them right now, but I think when school starts I'm going to switch them back um, because obviously I'll be spending more time in the office than I will be here and it's just, it's new, this is a new like school thing for me, you know, so I just feel like I just want it to be fresh but I really, really, really want to try it out because I think it's a really cool diffuser. So we're going to switch that up tonight. You guys can't even see me. Wait. <laughs> Lumi case coming in clutch. Oh my god, I look so bad. Let me just take it off. Ew, I look so bad. Okay, well, it is currently. Ugh. Come on, Lumi case. Let me out here. Help a sister out. It is currently 11:35. I've been trying to fall asleep for like an hour and a half now and I think the problem is that I'm hungry and I can't fall asleep so like we had tacos for dinner and tacos aren't my favorite so I just had um like I don't know I don't like the like togetherness of the meat and the bread I don't know I just think that's weird so I just had a little bit of meat plus I don't even really like taco meat so I didn't have a lot and you know then like I ate a lot of Cheez-Its which filled me up at the time but now I'm super hungry, so I've been trying to fall asleep for forever, and I think it's just because I'm hungry. But I have, like, my, my teeth brushed and everything, and then, like, if I wake a family member up, they're going to be pissed. So it is now the next day. I'm going to do my makeup. The appointment is at 1.30 and it's currently 10.02. So we have a couple of hours and I need to edit some videos. I need to do my hair, do my makeup and everything. So I'll catch up with you when I'm on my eyes so that you guys can see my eyes. Okay, so face, eyebrows, done. Eyes, next. So. Um, I'm going to prime my nose, like shove all the makeup off. Okay, so I'm going to prime my eyelids. This is actually concealer. This is the Revlon Age Defying Concealer. Um, I don't think they sell this anymore. Um, I think they stopped selling it quite a few years ago. Um, but I still have like a good amount of it and it's the best eyelid primer ever. Start with the eyeshadow. I'm quite excited. So if you guys um, don't remember, the, I'm trying out the Essence Fairy Wings and Magical Things palette. Um, very sparkly, and I think there's only one matte in there. That's probably why they didn't name how, which is which, how many of each. They yeah, like they usually just like 16, whatever, you know, like whatever. But this they just said an assortment of mattes, shimmers, and glitters. So if I'm going to use a crease color, I'm going to use this, because this is just a single eyeshadow, this Milani um, and Bella Cafe 04, great single eyeshadow. Um, I don't know, maybe I'll, I'll lightly put this in my crease to give myself definition. Okay. Oh, 
Okay, so I'm going to take a little bit of Off to Fantasyland in Treasure Island. Again, on a different... This is a different one. Wild Crease Brush. Actually, I'm going to get, um, like, a more fluffy one. Like, some of them, when I buy them, they're more fluffy and some of them are more dense. I don't know. But they're the same brush. So I'm going to take a little bit of Off to Fantasyland in Treasure Island on this brush. Oh, my crease. Okay, well, let's just kind of work it. Just kind of... Wow, this is quite pigmented, I must say. Like, I took very little, trust me. And it's definitely blue. <laughs> okay, I'm going to take a little bit of, I'm going to take my, I need to wash all my brushes after this. The Sephora crease brush, I'm going to take a little bit of Fairy On. A little bit. I'm gonna put that on the outer crease. I'm gonna take this Luxie Precise Shaper, the 239. I'm gonna take a little bit. It's more amazing. This one. Oops. Guys, so I never finished or showed you guys. I finished. I never showed you guys my finished makeup look. Um, so this is what it looks like. I put on individual lashes, like individual lash trios. Um, all over my lashes to like, you know, just kind of amp it up. Um, looks good. I put on like a nude pinky lip so that it just kind of dials it down a little bit. And then I wanted like my hair like cute like this. I don't know. Blue is defi definitely not an everyday color, especially when you have a lot of stuff to do. But whatever, it's fine. I'm editing a video. I have early orientation that was supposed to start yesterday for school. Um, but I never got the email for it, so I need to make sure on that today. I have the microblading thing with my mom. Um, I don't know if I ever specified that it's for my mom. It's not for me. Um, but I thought I'd do an OOTD. So, this is my outfit. It's very, very simple. So, my very good and fresh shirt, was we made it with the Cricut actually, but the shirt is from the dollar store. And we put very good and fresh on it. Um, this mermaid necklace that I actually added to my necklaces today is, I forget, my aunt and I got it when we were hanging out, but I can't remember if we got it at the Sawdust Festival. I can't remember exactly where we got it, but somewhere in California. Um, and then she just had the chain. We have my necklace, my Tiffany necklace that I wear every day. And then the same shorts that I always wear. Um, but yeah. I have like no um, space on this camera, but I have nothing that I can delete. So that's a dilemma. <laughs> hey guys, so it is now a lot later. It is 5.42. My package still doesn't come, which worries me because I went to the tracking number because the tracking number never works. It worked today. It's supposed to come USPS, but it's supposed to come today before 8 p.m. So um, yeah, and the FedEx came with the package. I was like, oh my god, it's mine, but it <gasps> wasn't. It was toilet paper. So, yeah. So, I'm gonna take a shower. I need to take a shower. So, hopefully, it comes today, but if it doesn't, great.